Hi, Scott here. Hope you're having a fantastic day today. I've just finished listening to this audio book by an author called John Maxwell. And he's done quite a few books. This, this particular book was called Failing Forwards. And he believes that the most, the most significant thing between uh, successful people and the ordinary people is how you deal with failure. I guess there's two parts. Firstly, and what you think of failure, and secondly, how you deal with it. So, so the first part, how do you think of failure? How do you consider failure? Do you consider failure to be, you know, a bad thing? Or do you, do you think failing is good? And, of course, all the successful people look at failure as a good thing. Because, basically, if you're not failing, you're not trying. Yeah, as I say, that if those who haven't, who haven't done anything wrong have never done anything. It's how you learn, right? You think of when you were a kid learning to walk. How many times did you fail? How many times did you fall over? Did you keep on going, right? So that's very significant. So it's your, your understanding of what your belief of failure is. Is it a good thing or a bad thing? And then the second thing is, if, is how you deal with it. So if you do fail, if you do something and it goes wrong, drastically wrong for instance, do you just give up? Or do you keep going and try something else? And he gave many good examples of people who have built or achieved great things in their life or built great companies or whatever. And there's a big story behind it. None of them basically just magically fell into the right, um, the, the right sort of business and the right, the right sort of thing they wanted to do. Um, it's all a matter of trial and error. They tried something and failed. But they just didn't give up. They just kept trying. They tried something else and tried something else. Now, I'm not suggesting that life has to be that hard, of course. These days, it's actually much easier to get, you know, to, to, to read books, listen to people, and, and just understand where, or learn from them, basically, learn from their mistakes. And it's much easier, more easier now, nowadays to get support as well. So again, you can learn from their mistakes and take some good guidance from um, how they managed to, to, to achieve the success that they, they've achieved. So yes, yeah, a good book if you want to want to have a read or a listen. Robert Maxwell, Failing Forwards. Definitely, um, it's obviously a whole book on just one subject, but the subject I think is pretty significant. And um, it is it is the big divider between those who who don't get very far in life and those who do. If you've got a dream, you've got to go for it. You keep failing, you keep trying, and eventually. You either succeed or you'll die first. Hopefully you won't die first and you'll succeed. And the chances are that you will. Just you mustn't take failures being, oh my word, I failed. What am I going to do now? Let's do something completely different or give up. You just mustn't do that. You must just keep on, keep on going. Keep on striving for the goals you're after. Whatever that might be. Whether it's your health, your wealth, whatever it is. Relationships. Just keep trying. So that's my message for today. I hope you're having a great day and uh, I'll be speaking to you soon. Scoff and build my lifestyle. Dream big and take lots of action. Even if you fail, keep trying. Take action. Speak to you soon. See ya. Hi, Scott here again. We live in a very different world than we did, say, 10 or 20 years ago. And the internet has really been taking off the last 20 years. And the world has changed so much in that time. And it means that there's so many more opportunities available to us now on the internet in this new digital world that we live in. So here at SFM, SFM is an education company. So what, we, what the SFM does is it, it's got two, two co-founders, Stuart Ross and Jay Kubzak, and they are, they're devoted, their vision is to help people create small businesses and create the freedom that we're looking for. And what they've done is they've created this education company and they've created a great environment around it. So not only do you get all the benefits of the SFM like all the, it's an education company, so all the training material that you need to start your small business. Um, not only do you have the training, but you also have all the tools. So you have all the tools for starting your own website, 
graphics generation, all these kind of things that you need to get your small business running. And on top of that, the whole, the whole environment and culture of the SFM, it's just fantastic because there are so many people there that are helping you. You're not just left on your own, here's the training, here's the tools, go and do it. So there are many people there at the SFM who have built their business up from scratch and they just want to help other people like us, like, like me and like you, create their small business and make a success of it. And therefore they're available to, to help you and you can learn so much from them. There's nothing better than learning from those who have been there before. Been where you are right now so they can help you, give you advice and help you get your business up and going as fast as possible. That's an awesome feature of the SFM. Another thing is lots of live events as well, all around the world. It's, it's, a, it's a worldwide uh, company with, with members from all over the world. And they have, they have um, live events in uh, different places around the world. Definitely worth going if you get a chance, or even make, make the chance to go. And there you will learn so much because not only are you being inspired by the people who are, who are doing very well, but you're meeting all these people as well. You're getting personal with them. And, and uh, you're just going to speak to them directly and ask, ask your questions and they can really help you out. It's really good to network. So if you're interested in joining the SFM so that you can, so that you can create a small business to create your freedom that you're looking for, then click on the, on the, on the uh, comment box, there'll be a link. Either you can watch the video series if you haven't seen it already, and you, or you can join my, um, my email list where I send the uh, email uh, lots of uh, video updates, like, like this, this uh, video I'm sending you right now. Um, and lots of tips and tricks to help you get your business started. So you can sign up for that, or if you want to get stuck straight in right away, then, then please do. There'll be a link down there for Get Started. And if you get started, then you'll be able to go straight into, into Module 1 of the essential five modules that you need to get your business running. Uh, it's $29.95 US dollars and it's fully refundable so in the first 30 days if you think SFM is not right for you for whatever reason it doesn't matter at least you tried it that's fine let us know and uh, you'll get your money refunded and then of course after that becomes the membership where you can then see the, the next of the five modules the rest of the five modules to allow you to create your business from scratch get it fully up and running and then go from there where you have access to all the training all the mentors, the coaches, everything you need to make a successful business. So, I'll be seeing you on the other side. Just click on the links below, come and join me at SFM and all the coaches and mentors will help you and I'll be here to help you as well. Hope you're along your way and I'll be speaking to you soon. Okay, catch you later. Scott from Build My Lifestyle.